In previous videos we've shown how the list is filtered uh, by uh, clicking a search button and then uh, submitting data in these search fields then uh, on the server side Alpha 5 takes the data that was submitted in these fields and computes the filter expression from the submitted data. But what if you want to enter the uh, filter expression yourself and not have Alpha 5 compute the filter for you from submitted data? So let's uh, go here and define an action for this button over here where we execute a um, custom filter. So we'll go back to design mode and then we'll um, go to action JavaScript um, and now we'll add a new action now for um, list control actions and the list control actions allows you to perform um, a whole variety of um, actions on the list control um, by using this builder over here so this just exposes the methods of the list control object so we would like to do a server side uh, filter and now we can specify the list that we'd like to operate on so that's list there and let's go here and type in our filter expression so we'll say city equals and then LON DON and then uh, put in the closing um, single quote go ahead there and then uh, save it and then go back to uh, working preview and then click the custom filter and we can see now that we've performed a custom filter so let's go back now and look at some of the other options that we have available to us here so we could instead of defining city equals London we could have gone here and used an argument say what city in that case uh, we'll now need to go and define the argument value so we need to define the value of this argument so we'll go here and type in London and we can see that the syntax calls for three pipes then the data type which is a character field and then the name of the argument what city so if we had more than one argument we would go on to the next line so we'll click OK now and then OK and now if we just say view JavaScript we can see that this is the JavaScript that Alpha 5 generated for us so we're calling the uh, filter list method we're filtering the list called list here's our filter expression we have no order expression and there are our argument values over there so go ahead close save go over to working preview now and click the button and we can see again that the uh, filter has been performed so by using the um, the um, filter list method uh, shown over here we're able to uh, create arbitrarily complex um, filter expressions to apply to our list and um, uh, we're ex uh, computing the filter expression ourselves rather than having alpha 5 computed from the uh, submitted data thanks very much for watching